So Sarah Jane's here, Chris is here. We've got the clips of Bingo sent in by you lot. Thank you. Are we ready? Oh, yes. Here we go. Watch this on the Radio 1 website. It's happening right now. You can see it live. Water spraying is happening. <laughs> <laughs> no hands, Sarah Jane. No hands. OK, good. <laughs> what? Nothing's happened. <laughs> <laughs> well, I like your nail varnish. Matches your lips. <laughs> Just noticed that. OK. Mm. Over to Five Live. Hey, you can watch this on the One Extra homepage too. And on Five Live, they make their reporters do some quite unusual things. You probably went along to the dressage initially in a slightly... Um, well, how would you describe your mood initially? Uh, Sceptical? Um, I, I sort of felt like I was ever so slightly being, uh, you know, asked to go and put my finger in the dike. <laughs> <laughs> Strong start. <laughs> wow. I know. Woo. Those equestrians. Oh, wow. Craig in Wales spotted that. I sort of felt like I was ever so slightly being asked to go and put my finger in the dike. Now, if we could have some more water, please. Fill your cheeks. Go on. Nice big bit. That was a great one. Oh, that's and seeping through. Hang on. Already? Yeah. <laughs> I just got to adjust myself. Have you just soiled yourself? Because Sarah Jane, <laughs> Sarah Jane didn't spit that far. It's just gone right through. Okay. <laughs> okay. Right. Don't be afraid to get over him, Sarah Jane. <laughs> <laughs> Sarah Jane, whatever your name is. <laughs> <laughs> oh God, sorry. You still got it. Okay, good. <laughs> <laughs> Amy's been on. I'm good. She's been watching Country File. <laughs> what is going on here? Blimey, it's heavy. Ready? Yeah, ready? It'll get heavier. OK. Go on. <laughs> Hang fire. Ooh, ooh. Blimey. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what that is. <laughs> OK. I think we're all fine. No water has been spilt. This might get you. It's a classic from Sarah Cox. The picture there that's up on the on Radio 1 online, it's me trying to hold back my lips. <laughs> <laughs> oh, straight in the face. <laughs> oh, that was a bad one. <laughs> you! Look at me! You! Look at my leggings! Oh, no, your leggings. You've got to carry on with the rest of your show. <laughs> I didn't have this down as a wet one, if I'm honest. I thought this was just going to be a nice, sensible... <laughs> That's because I've won, Sarah Jane, to soak you. Right, OK. Josh in Carlisle says, there's 15 of us in a circle playing along in sixth form common room at <laughs> Nelson Tomlinson School. That's brilliant. <laughs> Rachel says, I've never watched this before. My life is now complete. <laughs> Julian, give yourself some points. Thank you for this one. I have no idea what they're on about here. This is Jonathan and Annabelle. And they're on BBC Northampton. My envelope's a bit manky. Oh! It's one of those ones that you, you'd never want to lick. Yes, this looks a little... I tell you mm. what's, what's happened with the gluey bit, it's gone brown. Mm, same I, here. I wonder whether Les is a hardened pipe smoker. Oh, do you think? With a brown tongue that's licked this. Oh, oh. oh. look at the devil. Hello, Liz. What is going on? <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Liz. <laughs> what? That's why I love BBC local radio. <laughs> because it's awesome. Sometimes I listen to it late at night when I'm going uh, to do student gigs. My favourite is, um, what's his name? Uh, I can't remember his name. <laughs> Paul, somebody, Paul. He's brilliant anyway. He's on the South Coast um, local radio. Check him out. Paul Miller. Paul. So, just Paul. <laughs> Paul. Paul Miller. Because he says to every caller, bye 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 <laughs> And there's not enough people on radio saying that. <laughs> OK. Jamie and Derby. Ready? Ready. Mm -hmm. This is Fern Cotton, whose listeners tell her everything. Martin on Twitter has also had a, a whack off his fiance in the night. <laughs> Screaming about something, crawling up her arm anyway. <laughs> God bless you, Fern. <laughs> Who's wettest at the moment? Sort of, um, yeah, well, no, it's a bit of a draw. We're all right. Okay. You're right, Sarah Jane? Mm -hmm. she's, Happy? she's holding it in quite a bit, actually. <laughs> yeah. Don't be afraid, My like hands. I say. Mm -mm. Don't hold back. Mm. Oh, that's right. And if you sit up nice and straight, then you can get a good projectile. <laughs> Just a little tip there. 
OK, that's it. Lizzie from Pudsey. <laughs> and also Paddy on Twitter spotted this one. And it's over to Coronation Street. And Deirdre has an offer for Ken Barlow. Ken, are you going to stay up there all night? You're going to miss me stuffed marrow. Well, that's hardly going to tempt him down. <laughs> <laughs> Sarah Jane went for it there. Chris, not so much. You okay, Chris? Mm. <laughs> you can swallow that one. Okay. Swallow. New, <laughs> new water, please. Oh. Sorry. You don't really spray, do you? You just sort of concentrate it all. And... <laughs> Ken, are you going to stay up there all night? You're going to miss me stuffed marrow. No one wants that. No. <laughs> okay, ready? Right, ready. Uh, yeah, let's do it. And now it's time for a classic from Holby City. A bit harsh, maybe? Sorry? Do you have some feedback about my managerial style? Christian, I can hold the fort if you want to have some downtime. No, I'm fine, thank you. Come on. It's muffin o'clock. <laughs> Straight in the face! Sarah Jane got it good. I was doing it right over my chest. Oh, no, it really is on, you. <laughs> on there now. Yeah. Oh, wow. I'm sorry, I didn't know that one. I've never muffin heard that one. Come on. It's muffin o'clock. Mm. <laughs> oh, that was a bad one. That was oh, a bad one. My goodness. I really hope you're watching this on the website. <laughs> Radio 1 and 1 Extra homepage. <laughs> OK, we're going over to Newsbeat now for the next one. Oh, no. Do you need to cover up? More water, please. <laughs> <laughs> OK. <laughs> oh, you should play this more often. It's fun with you. Yeah. <laughs> now, let's all just think about this for a second. Imagine if you were dating Boris Johnson. Hmm. He would commentate on everything. And we've come now to the final tear-sodden, juddering climax. <laughs> <laughs> Delayed reaction. <laughs> I'd not thought of it like that. Well, you have now. Oh. You're right, Sarah Jane? <laughs> well held, well composed. <laughs> All right. More water? And you're good, Sarah Jane, because you didn't spit it last time. Mm. Sam Morgan's been on. And a shocking confession here from 999, what's your emergency? The way I live my life is in quite a anally obsessive way. <laughs> oh, a little spurt from Sarah Jane. <laughs> Chris, anything to offer? Mm. No, fine. <laughs> oh, oh, what happened there? Why did you suddenly go? <laughs> the way you said that. No, that fine. <laughs> kind of weird. All right, back over to Coronation Street. Dylan Morris spotted this one. Ken Barlow wasn't interested, but Deirdre found someone who was. Ready? Mm -hmm. Thank you for your <laughs> stuffed marrow, Deirdre. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> There's some quite weird ones today, but I like it. <laughs> oh, she's struggling. SJ, come back. Come back. Thank you for your stuffed marrow, Deirdre. Oh. Oh, yeah. So unnecessary. <laughs> <laughs> that was, oh, I'm so sorry. That was a good game. Don't apologise. That's the rules. That's the rules of the game. He's supposed to get wet. And that was Innuendo Bingo the Jewel.